first step is to use imaging to quantify and characterize the hip dysplasia. That will guide treatment. If the patient is young enough and requires treatment, then we can institute bracing, such as a pablic harness or special brace that improves the positioning of the hips at rest. If we can use that method, then I'll perform serial imaging exams, such as ultrasounds, to follow the progression and the improvement. If a child is older or the disease is more severe and the hip is dislocated, then we may have to discuss surgical options. In some cases, hip dysplasia can improve on its own in very young patients, young babies. But in most cases, hip dysplasia that goes untreated can lead to early osteoarthritis, degenerative hip disease, requiring hip joint replacement as a young adult.